Hey everybody, how's it going? I have some pretty good news. Uh, today I am officially a CCNP. I went ahead and took the uh, CCNP uh, T-shoot exam and I passed it. So I'm quite happy about that. Um, I actually notified you guys a little bit late as far as like when I actually took the switch exam as well as a route. So I didn't do it as quick as you might think I did, but I did study for the T-shoot pretty quickly. Um, I've heard people say things like that you shouldn't take too long with it. Um, it's a simple exam, so I just studied for like, what was it, like two weeks, and then I took it, and that was enough for me to pass it. So it was a really cool exam, actually. I, I really enjoyed it. And uh, I actually really want to share with you guys what is it that I used in order to pass the exam. So um, I probably will make a video about that uh, next, but man, I, I'm just so happy. Um, uh, it's like a weight off of my shoulders, really. Uh, it's it's like something that you you know you're just carrying that with you, and to finally get to the point where you want to be, it's just it feels good, and um, hopefully I'll be moving on to my CCIE um, soon. Um, it depends on what my employers say and and things like that but uh, I'm pretty sure I'll be moving on to it you know in maybe about a month or so but I need to take a bit of a break and but not too long of a break to forget everything I've learned which I doubt because I'm still doing stuff like this at work and whatnot so <laughs> anyway so um do you guys have any questions uh, just let me know uh, I'm very tired it's kinda late but I need to make this video and put it out there and uh, thank everybody uh, who has been out there uh, supporting me, my family, my girlfriend, um, but also those of you who watch me, um, whether you be from this country or from other countries, I always get uh, uh, people uh, from Iraq or from India um, and I really like that. I work with a lot of people from other countries. and. Uh, I think it's, it's it's really cool to see people from other countries watching my videos and uh, being inspired by them. And uh, I look at them and I read them and I think, you know, what can be so inspiring about me? You know, I, I just don't see it, but I, I appreciate it. And I appreciate you all watching my videos and liking them and sharing them with people. Um, I really think I can provide better content for you all. Um, it's just a matter of uh, trying to find some time aside from my studying, and hopefully I'll be able to do that now that I'm going to take a little bit of a break before I get back to my CCIE stuff. Um, so once again, thank you all so much for your wonderful support, um, for your wonderful words and your questions that you guys ask me, because you guys definitely keep me on my feet uh, you guys definitely keep me wanting to continue studying every day I mean it's been such a such a struggle man I, I can't I can't tell you I mean I've put off a lot of things you know to get here and to be sure that I pass the exams and lots of labbing lots of labbing so well uh, um, speaking of labbing, I will have to start purchasing some of my things for the uh, CCIE lab. Um, to name a few, like the 30, 3650s. So that's going to be something that I, I'm going to have to worry about soon. And uh, hopefully I'll have the financial capabilities to do that uh, without having too many problems. So... Oh, I'm sorry, I'm getting hiccups here. But um, thank you all again. <laughs> I, I, I just can't uh, say it enough. Thank you all for the support. And um, any way that I can give back to you all, um, you know, by answering a simple question or running a simple scenario, um, anything I can do for you guys. You know, I'm here. Uh, stay focused and stay inspired. Uh, I'll see you all next time. Bye.